Here we go again. This is Jack from CruiseCasinoMafia.com. And I believe this video is probably going to show up as a Friday freebie system, uh, most likely at the end of this week. I'm recording it earlier in the week because things are starting to get a little bit busy here with the holidays coming up, finishing up some business stuff and things of that nature. So this is another roulette system. We are on a tear over the last two weeks with roulette systems. I promised my Baccarat crowd that we have some really interesting stuff coming up uh, for Baccarat as well as some craps videos. Um, but today is a crazy one. So this is not a conservative system. So <laughs> this channel is known for uh, conservative money management and conservative systems. Well, this is not going to be one of them. So this is kind of interesting. It's not my system. It is a system that uh, that has been introduced to me. And listen, um, we try to vary things up here, right? We try to vary up what we're showing. They can't all be stuff that I normally am attracted to. So um, with that being said, I'm going to show you how it's played. Um, you do need a bankroll. So let's just be really careful with this. If you're going to do this type of progression, it's going to cost you 88 units. 88 units. That's correct. Now, the point here is that you can build it up. So if you have a few runs, uh, you, you're going to try to build it up and build up your bankroll to do this. Now, for me... I'm going to be honest with you. The only way I would play this is online with, uh, you know, small, uh, small bets. Um, you know, I probably would not be playing this anytime in the near future in a brick and mortar casino. But you can certainly build things up and then uh, take your money from online and play this live. Or uh, if you demo it and you really like it, it certainly is something that you can play live if you have the proper bankroll. So this system is based on repeaters, okay? And you've heard me use that term before, but for new people, let's go through it. So a repeater is basically what we're, what we're calling something that happens back to back. So in this system, we're going to use the dozens, okay? Now you can use the columns. It's exactly the same amount of numbers. It's exactly the same math. We'll use the dozens. That's how the, uh, the person that plays this system uh, uh, sent it in and showed me how they play it. So the point here is that dozens repeat. And what you're banking on here is that the dozen is going to repeat within six steps, so if you look to your right here, there's six progressions, and you're looking for the dozen to repeat, um, you know, at one point during those six. And that's what this is based on. So make your own decision, demo this out. And what the person that uses this does is he's looking for four to five runs, meaning that he jumps in here and has four to five wins at some point here um, and then quits for the day. OK, and that's how he's building up bankrolls so that when he does have that bad day and it goes six times without repeating, uh, it's not the end of the world. So let's just demo this and see how it feels. So what we'll do is we're just going to use uh, to make my life easier. We're just going to use single I, I, it's, uh, uh, dollar units so we can just use this. OK, so it's an eighty eight dollar bankroll here for one run. And we're going to use uh, $1 units. And yes, I know that unless you're online, you cannot make dollar bets on the dozens. Now, how do we start this? You can certainly be more patient. And I believe that's what he does and waits for a dozen to not repeat four or five times before he plays it. But we'll just jump in and pick a dozen at random and we'll see how that looks. So we'll pick the third dozen and we're gonna bet $1. Uh, we're gonna bet $5, I'm sorry, we're gonna bet $5. Okay, whoop, hold on one second, I'm on the wrong thing. So we're not betting single units, I'm sorry, I confused myself. We're gonna just use the exact numbers here. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do, all right? Well, actually, you know what we can do? You know what we can do? Um. Yeah, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to bet, hold on, delete this. We're going to do single units. 
So we're going to do, um, we're going to do five, right? Oh my God. Why am I doing this? Oh, because it's not allowing me to do the single units, is it, on the outside? All right. So we're going to do a, we're going to do a fifth, we'll use $10 units then. So we'll use, we're going to do a $50 bet. Okay. A $50 bet. Um, is that going to really work out for us here? 50, 70, 100, 140. Yeah, I guess I guess we can try that. So let's go ahead and do that. So we'll just pretend like they're, uh, they're $10 units. So this is going to be a $50 bet. It's a $5 unit. Um, no, a five, yes, a five unit bet. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. All right, so we lost. And so now we're going to be doing 70 right? We're going to be doing 70. So we're going to bet the same as the last one because we're looking for the repeater. So that was a second uh, uh, dozen. So we're gonna, now we're going to do a $70 bet. Okay. And let's see. And what we're looking for is a repeater within six. And we got it right away. Okay, there we go. So that's one run completed, right? One run completed. So now what we'll do is we will bet, we'll switch it up, right? So now uh, that one's come in um, twice. So now we're going to switch it up and now we'll do a third 12, right? We'll do a third. To, actually, no, we're not really supposed to do that. Well, yes, we are. Yes, we are. So we're going to do a $50 bet again here. And we're resetting, right? We're resetting. We're on run number two. And we won instantly. Okay, instantly. So that's two runs completed. All right. And we'll switch it up and we'll go back to the second 12. So we've completed two runs at this point. We lost. So now we're going to move to the third 12 and look for the repeater with a seven unit bet. And remember, we're getting paid two to one on these um, dozen bets. All right, look at that. So that's three runs that we completed so far, right? We're up $280, okay? So now we're going to switch it up again. Those were three runs. We're looking for four to five runs. Let's go, let's stick with the, let's stick, let's go with the second 12. And let's do our uh, first bet again here. All right, that's once again a third 12. So now we're going to look for the repeater and we're going to go for a $70 bet on the third 12 and look for uh, a repeater. And we're on bet number two. We lost. So now we're on bet number three, which is going to be a $100 bet. And we're here because the first 12 is the one that came in. So we're always betting for the repeater. All right, so here we go. And we won. All right, so that's four runs right there. We're up $360. That's pretty amazing. Now I know I'm, I'm playing $50 bets and, and, and all of that, but, um, but we're just looking to see how this plays out. So that was four runs. So we'll, we'll go for the fifth run and then we'll quit. So let's switch it up again and let's look for a second 12. We'll go back to our $50 bet. And we won instantly. Okay, instantly. So do you see, this is pretty interesting, right? This is pretty interesting. We never went past the third one and we did complete five runs. All right, we did complete five runs uh, for four hundred and sixty dollars. Obviously, that's because we were playing um, that we were playing fifty dollar bets, our fifty dollar or ten dollar units, ten dollar units, and we put and we did a five five unit bet of fifty dollars. Right. So let's let's just keep going here, just to show a little bit more action. Even though we would have stopped here because we did complete four to five runs. All right, let's try again. So let's go ahead and start with a uh, third 12. All right, third 12 for 50.
and we won instantly. So that's run number one completed, right? And now what we'll do is we'll go back to the second 12 and start over at our five unit bet. And we're going to be looking for our second run to be completed. And we did. Look at that. So we got our second run completed instantly. Um, let's go back to the third 12. We're looking for our third run to be completed. And we lost. So now we're going to make our second bet. And that's going to be a $70 bet here because we're looking for the repeater on the first dozen. We lost. We're going to be going to our 10 unit bet and we're going to be making that here. We lost, so for the first time, we are going to be making our fourth progression bet, which is 140, and that's going to be in our third, uh, let's see, 140, okay. So let's see if we hit this fourth progression. We did not. So it's taking us to the fifth progression, which is $210, right, or 21 units. So let's do that here and see what happens. So you can see you need quite a bit of money to do this, obviously, with a $10 bet. And we hit it. Okay. So there you go. So that was a little bit nerve-wracking, right? We got to our fifth bet on that one. Um, so let's do it again. So let's go back. And for this, for this session, we're up $720. So let's now go back to our $5 bet, and let's go back to the third 12. And I'm picking these at random to start with by the way, as if we were starting just a completely new session. You can do whatever you want on that initial trigger. Obviously, you know after the initial trigger, if you don't hit it, you're going to be following whatever came before because we're looking for the repeater. But you can use whatever initial trigger you want. Okay, here we go. So let's see if we can hit a third 12. And we did immediately. So that I think was another, if I'm not wrong, that would be back to back five, you know, five, we hit four or five runs and I think we hit another four or five runs. So we'll stop it there. Very interesting. And remember, um, if you can play online and these units are a dollar each or two dollars each, it's not that bad. Playing what we just did with $10 units requires a fairly large bankroll because this totals up to $88. So that would be $880 bankroll here per run. And you may say to yourself, well, that's not that bad, $880. Well, it's not that bad as long as you are building up like we did here, where you now have a full bankroll. So if you lost the bankroll, you'd be at break even. Um, and that's the reason why uh, our guy that does this always tries to quit with four to five runs because if he can build up those runs and build up the bankrolls, he can afford to lose once in a while the six in a row, all right? Because that is going to happen. We all know that. This is roulette, right? So we know that's going to happen. So um, you can test this out. This is a little bit more action-oriented for people that are looking for that. This is obviously not... Uh, my type of money management, that's for sure. So this is out of my comfort zone. But it's not out of my comfort zone if you're playing for dollar or two dollar units. You know, so this bet here is, you know, it's not that big of a deal. But um, but if you're playing for bigger money, this is, uh, you're going to need quite a bit of a bankroll to maintain through a six progression loss multiple times. So check it out yourself. Uh, you saw it work pretty good for us here, but this is not a long demonstration. Uh, we're only on here for 14 minutes right now. So a lot more due diligence needs to happen for anybody to feel comfortable playing this. But I just wanted to show you another system. It's a little bit out of my comfort zone. Um, obviously, you saw it did pretty good. And yes, we know that the dozens do repeat regularly, like we just saw, right? Like we just saw. But there are runs where the dozen doesn't come in for a while. And that gets a little hairy. So check it out yourself. Test this out. Have a great time. And we will see you on another video real soon. Bye-bye.